so so good afternoon my dear student i hope you all are fine today we are going to start a new chapter of human body that of science that is the excretory system so in the previous class we have read about digestive system now we will read about excretory system okay so in digestive system we have learned that the digestive system undergoes the process of digestion here the excretory system undergoes the process of excretion excretory system undergoes the process of excretion okay it is x it is c excretion now what is excretion the definition is very important you will get in your exam excretion is the process of excretion means process of i think i should increase the width process of getting process of getting rid of this definition you have to learn okay you should not make any change in the definition rid of waste waste products waste products what are these waste product i will tell you but for the time being you write the definition waste products from the body from the body is called as excretion okay fine so what are these waste products now our body conducts different different metabolic process different different metabolic process so through this metabolic process we get some waste products that are not required by the body for example if i will say in digestion in digestion we take the food the important part of the food get digested by the body and it is absorbed by the small intestine and the waste product which is not digested is goes to the large intestine and expelled out of the body through the anus similarly when we cook food when we cook food we cut the vegetables before cutting the vegetables we peel off their upper part okay we peel off their skin why we peel off them because that is not required so that is a waste for us so we throw that so excretion means the the process of getting rid of that waste products only okay that is very important to get rid of that waste products now what are the waste products waste products includes nitrogenous waste nitrogenous waste means it will contain some nitrogen compounds nitrogenous like your urea uric acid that is not required just you remember nitrogenous waste this is also not required carbon dioxide carbon dioxide is a waste in the process of respiration you will learn in class 5 about detail about respiration now you only remember carbon dioxide and also sweat Sweat. These are the three major waste products of our body. Now, for these three major waste products, we are having three major excretory organs. For nitrogenous waste, for this nitrogenous waste, we have basically kidney. Kidney is the organ for this nitrogenous waste. For this carbon dioxide, CO two, we have lungs. You see. lungs lungs 
helps us to expel out carbon dioxide from the body okay which is used by the plants and this sweat sweat is removed by the sweat glands so these three are the major excretory organs of the body yes you can also say that large intestine is also a excretory organ but it absorbs water also so let's move forward note it down retain now my dear children we will learn about urinary system now what is this urinary system we have learned that kidney removes the nitrogenous waste from our body so the urinary system is the major system of excretion or the main system of excretion main system of excretion is the urinary system most of the excretion of the body is done by the urinary system main system for excretion main system for excretion main system for excretion so uh, lungs expel out the waste in form of carbon dioxide uh, sweat glands expel out wa waste in form of sweat so this urinary system expel out waste in form of urine urine from where it expel out from the blood the when this blood goes to this urinary system it filters the blood and expels out or throws out all the waste products in form of urine okay if i i will say in normal language it is called toilet we go to the toilet to do urine so that are waste that is a waste product of the body so what is there in the urinary system you look at the urinary system there are two bean shaped organs you see this diagram is very much important there is two bean shaped organs which is the major organ for the urinary system that is your kidney that is your kidney and this kidney is are called the filters of the body filters of the body you will get a question which part of the body are called filters of the body kidney they are called the filters of the body why the they are called the filters of the body because they filter the blood we have in our home aqua aqua guard or uh, purit all these are filter of water water filters but here kidney acts as a blood filter it filters the blood and collects all the waste materials from the cells and all parts of the body and takes them to the kidneys see what happens blood moves throughout the body so blood collects all the waste particles from different cells tissues muscles everything and takes it to the kidney and everything get filters in the kidney okay so after that the urine moves to the urinary bladder you see this is the urinary bladder through a pipe called as ureter this pipe is called as ureter first the blood enters here the blood enters through the artery this is the artery we we'll learn what is artery in class 5 this is the artery the blood enters and go goes to the ureter and gets stored in the urinary bladder and from here urine is expelled out through the urethra okay you when you feel urination urine is expelled out through this urethra this is the outer part of the body they are all present in inside this is the outer part of the body urethra this diagram is very much important you may get as a two mark question so now we'll move forward that is how to keep excretory system healthy 
so okay so it is very important to filter our blood and remove all the waste particles so we have to keep our excretory system healthy so how we will keep that we have to drink plenty of water okay minimum 12 glasses a day drink plenty of water plenty of water we have to drink much water to keep our excretory system healthy and also we have to eat healthy diet healthy diet is very important no junk food fast food all should be avoided healthy diet okay we should eat vegetables grains milk which keep the excretory system healthy and the main most important point is do not hold back your urine when you feel urination you should go to the toilet do not hold back urine if you will hold back your excretory system may get damaged so do not hold back your urine when you feel urination please go to the toilet you should go to the toilet because these are the waste products no they have to expelled out from the body they have to be thrown out from the body okay so for today this much my dear children stay tuned and uh, like and subscribe to the channel so for today only this much thank you bye bye and take care